Alice in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll. Chapter One. Down the Rabbit Hole. Alice was sitting on the grass by her sister, who was reading a book. Alice did not like the book because there were no pictures in it. What's the use of a book without pictures in it? Thought Alice. Shall I get up and go to pick some flowers, or shall I not? No, the day is too hot. Oh, I am so sleepy. Suddenly, a white rabbit with pink eyes ran past her. Oh, I shall be late! I shall be late! He cried. A rabbit that can talk. Alice did not think it very funny at first, but when the rabbit took a watch out of its pocket and looked at it, Alice jumped to her feet. She started after the rabbit. It ran to a rabbit hole in the ground and jumped into it. Alice went down after it at once, but she did not go down the hole. She fell. She fell down, down, down. She was falling very slowly, so she had time to think and to look about. At first, she tried to look down and see what was in the hole, but it was too dark and she could see nothing. Then she looked at the walls and saw a lot of shelves on them. There were maps and pictures here and there. On one of the shelves, she saw a jar. She took it from the shelf and read "marmalade," but there was no marmalade in it. She did not want to drop the jar. She was afraid to kill somebody. She was still falling down, so she put the jar on another shelf as she was falling past it. Well, thought Alice, after this fall, I shall not be afraid to jump from trees. Down, down, down. Am I falling through the earth? Said Alice. It will be so funny to see the people on the other side of the earth. Do they walk with their heads down? I shall not know where I am. I shall ask them politely to tell me the name of their country. They will think that I am a very stupid girl. Down, down, down. There was nothing else to do. So Alice soon began to talk again. Poor Dinah, what will she do without me this evening? Dinah was her cat. I hope they will not forget to give her some milk to drink. Dinah, my dear, I am so sorry you're not here with me. Oh, but what can cats eat here? I am sure there are no mice in the air. Suddenly, the fall was over. Alice jumped to her feet. Before her eyes, there lay a long corridor. The white rabbit was running along it. Quick, thought Alice. I must be quick. And she ran after the rabbit. The rabbit turned the corner, and she heard the words, "It's so late, so late." Alice could not run so quickly as the rabbit, and soon it was out of sight.